know, it's really great when we can showcase a program that helps children reach for something more. Yes, we found something that actually teaches Camden High School students all about television production. It's called Camden City Kids Productions, and I went to visit. Check it out. If image is everything, a 12-year-old Camden boy is killed in a barrage of bullets. One person dead after a shooting in Camden, New Jersey. Like other urban areas, Camden is having problems with violence, shootings, and murders. Then the city of Camden, New Jersey, needs an extreme makeover. But some kids say it's not as bad as it looks on television, mm -hmm. and they are out to prove it. Welcome back to Get to Know Before You Judge. I'm Giovanni Medina. This is a taping of the first television show produced by Camden City Kids Production Company, a group of young people, all from Camden, that want to change the negative image of their city. The teenagers work cameras, host, direct, and come up with topics for their own show. It's called Get to Know Before You Judge. Previously on 2020, they were saying that Camden can't do nothing, that Camden is bad or whatever. They didn't show the good side of Camden, like, me and the other students, they showed that, like basically almost the entire U.S., I think, of uh, how Camden is and didn't show them the truth. Mm -hmm. That's why we decided to make this show, get to know before you judge. And so if you had to tell those same people that saw that 2020 interview what Camden is really like, what the young people are really like, what would you tell them? Not all the people in Camden are alike. There are all types of people in Camden. They have different talents. There's talent in Camden. It's belief in that talent and the desire to encourage young people in Camden that led Cynthia Primus to create City Kids Productions. In this city in particular, um, we have not given our children the opportunity to really even believe that they have potential. You need to do, you need to do, uh, get to know before you judge, okay? The students are taught by artist teachers with experience in television and film. Ozzie Davis is a writer and director. We taught them the process of this is how you make film, this is how, or TV in particular. Uh, this is, you know, how you, how, some of the writing that needs to happen, some of the structure stuff, shot listings, you know, and then let them do it. And he's seen the impact this program can have firsthand. I've seen children who could not say their name above a mumble, you know, be able to to learn and recite text. Like, that's tangible. Today we have a special guest, Nori Wilson from The Morning Show. How you doing? I'm doing fine. Good. The students interviewed me on their show. Giovanni Medina, who hopes to attend business school, is hosting today for the first time. How did you get to where you're at right now? I started off actually just like you. Right here. I worked with a bunch of other high school kids. We put together our own talk show. It was pretty hard. It was nerve-wracking, actually. But after I got used to it, I just flowed right with it. And he wasn't the only one trying something new. Floor director. That was my first day. I was kind of nervous. <laughs> and so what do you have to do as a floor director? Um, just, just count down and, you know, give them the time. The they got left, three minutes, one minute, wrap it up, stuff like that. For all of these young people, City Kids Productions is an opportunity to grow. For the first time, like, I was in charge of something. Like, I could see my work being done. Through arts, they develop the skills. They develop the behaviors, the disciplines. They then develop the aspirations. And then all of a sudden, academic achievement goes up. We got time to sit here and express and express like our talents, do what we do best, and you know, get together, talk, you know, and work. They've been to a photography studio. They've met makeup artists. We have people like the sound and light, uh, um, Patty Labelle's light person, you know, we met him and we went on the channel 10, uh, the 10 show. Good morning, you're watching the 10 show. Uh, my name is Amy Reeves from Camden City Kids Production. Having those kinds of experiences um, it just brought a different kind of inspiration to the children. I don't think they knew what to expect this summer and neither did we. So we think that this is something, something's happening here. So we're going to continue with this. And I'm so proud of my own.
And what a great group of young people. For more information about Camden City Kids Productions, you can head to our website, NBC10.com slash 10, and look under links. Yeah, we were really impressed when they came to see our show. Yes, they and did a great to job. to see that, they're making some steady progress. And I gotta say, their plastic flowers on their set probably look better than <laughs> our plastic flowers on our set. Maybe we could get some help from set design. Maybe what do you so. Think? <laughs> All right, we're back with more 10 right after this.